first thing we're gonna talk about here, I got I got mentioned, I got mentioned in a few places. I got mentioned, actually I got fucking slandered, I would say. I would say slandered is maybe the more appropriate word. Lizzyworksbeats.com. Okay, so he posted this video, is Mo dead in the water? I'm proud of him, dude, he, I'm proud of him. He's becoming a massive hater. Very important for this conversation. If you don't have that information and you got bad information, from people like Weaver Beats who don't do any research and talk crap about companies without any research. Should be ashamed for making this video, putting out false information like this, lying to get views on YouTube. Lying to get views on YouTube? That's fucked up, Busy Work Beats. I thought we were friends, man. You know what? I don't want to be underneath your umbrella anymore. Okay, so we got $1,000 studio versus $10 studio. Who makes a better beat? We already know the answer to this, right? We already know the answer to this. It doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. If anything, it might be a little bit harder to do it in a large studio because like it, you don't, it's not as optimized for workflow, you know? Unless like you have like piano players or whatever and you're recording them, maybe like expert musicians, that might help a bit. But yeah, we know it doesn't matter. All right, let's check this out. 17 minutes, hopefully it's good. Don't disappoint us, produced by Jack. Right now, I'm in Metropolis Studio in London, which is a crazy lit, expensive studio. I've got two teams of producers. One team is going to stay here at Metropolis, which is over a thousand dollars to rent for one day. And the other what do you guys think about this? Whenever I see someone with the setup where they have the monitors and the tweeters are on the inside, I don't know what to think because like I've heard people will do it both ways before, but I don't understand why you would do that. You know, because like usually the lows are supposed to be more in the center and then the highs are supposed to be on the outside. If you had the tweeters on the inside, then your highs are going to be in the center and then your lows are going to be on the outside, your lows and mids. So it's kind of like, why would you do this? I don't, I never understand that what do you guys think in the chat is anyone does anyone have any like arguments why you would do this let me know please because i i never could figure it out i just feel like it's not a good idea honestly wanted the same because it's really throwing off your perception of the way you're hearing it mixing too because like not many people are gonna be listening to it like this either duh because it's the opposite day oh okay well maybe that's why over a thousand dollars to rent for one day and the other team is going to be going to a cheap studio nearby so we're gonna see if dude that's that was a sink that was like a doctor's office dude that was a doctor's office. that's a sink in a doctor's office okay Okay, that's <laughs> what the hell is this? You paid ten dollars to go here? What do you mean? <laughs> you paid what? I mean, I think you could have just stayed in your room, man. This is like a doctor's office in, in like the back room at a show or something. Don't some speakers have options for laying down or standing up? I think they might, but I don't think the the Yam well, maybe the Yamahas do. I don't know. Virgin worrying about speaker setup versus Chad mixing on twenty dollar Target headphones with one broken ear. One of the headphones is broken. So we're gonna see if it makes a difference, and we're gonna flip a sample. I mean, there's nothing wrong with having them on the side, though. That's the thing. You can have them on the side. What I'm talking about it's like having the monitor on the side but what seems like the wrong way that's more so what i'm talking about i feel like you're not really getting a real comparison with this though unless it's the same producers in each studio and also you could have you could have a good or bad day in either in either situation so there's no real way to like really measure this but i get it it's a good topic and a good title and thumbnail whichever team makes the best beat is gonna win so let's get into it now we're gonna spin the wheel and find out who's going to the uh the worst studio and who's staying here all right, Ocean. <laughs> Ocean's the first one. Okay, cool. Dude, what was the audio there? All of a sudden, it's just super noisy. Ooh. No. Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Joss. So close as well. Wait, is this for the ten dollars studio or the? Honestly, I'd probably work. I'd rather work at the ten dollars studio. There's less distractions. You didn't escape it. I thought it was gonna go <laughs> so the teams are me, Link, and Louis versus Lona, Jay, and Ocean. Each team is gonna get one hour to flip the sample, and whoever makes the best beat will win the challenge. Let's find out what sample we're gonna be using today. <laughs> It was super funny if you just gave them some absolute trash. Do they get expensive sounds? Because that is really what matters. So I'm bringing my laptop. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It doesn't really matter that much. I mean, maybe this is more so for beginners that don't know if it matters, you know? Either way, we're going to watch it regardless. This is dope. I could do some crazy shit with that. Any of them. Yeah, I don't mind you. Know, I like the second one. Yeah. I like the Brazilian one. Like the first one. one yeah. All right, we've been sent on our way to the Uber. Jack made us drive four hours to go to a pirate studio. All right, we're arriving into pirate studios now. Buttons are missing on the thing. Oh my god, that's super funny. There's like no door to get into it. No way. <laughs> With Venus is the star. Oh. The second one make a good lo-fi beats track. I was thinking more of like a trap, some like a trap sort of thing or like a wave thing. Oh, it's quite big. Oh, this is not the $10 studio. Okay. Oh, boys. One hour, three, two, one. Let's go. Right. Wait. 
One hour. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, we need to see a better shot of the studio. That didn't look like a $10 studio to me, man. Okay, wait, this is the this is the $1,000 one, right? Oh, this one's $10. They're talking about $10 a day, I'm thinking. Maybe that's what it's saying. Why watch this stuff when you could just watch cute animals falling over? I don't know. I'm getting a lot of enjoyment out of this, to be honest. I mean, I can watch cute animals falling over, too. Oh, it's quite big. Uh, that's ten dollars a day, dude. That's not bad. <laughs> Wait, I think this is the star. Man, I thought it was gonna be way worse, man. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I mean, it really doesn't matter now. All right, boys. One hour. Three, two, one. Let's go. All right. One hour. Let's go. Let's go. Honestly, I feel like it would be best to start with the percussion because then we get the basis for like what the beat is. Oh, and we only have one hour. I'm sure this guy's mostly pros, dude. I watched a video today of animals getting hit in the balls, funny stuff. I feel like that's unethical. Put the animals on the lower half of the screen to keep people's attention or Minecraft parkour. <laughs> Holy shit, that's funny. Okay, wait, hold on, son. Cute ant, wait, let's... Oh, let me make this really small. Is this gonna work? Okay, here we go. What the hell is this ad here? What the hell is this fucking ad? Can I skip the ad? I d skip the ad, man. Come on. <laughs> what kind of ad? What in the ab workout is this shit here? All right, we need to keep people's attention here, so we're gonna play abs. How do I skip it? I, I put it as a, as a browser source on OBS. Oh my god, is it gonna play the full ad? This is bullshit. This is bullshit right now. The unison audio of working out. Okay, hold on. That's not gonna work. Let me do it a different way. Okay, I'm just gonna do this then. I wanted to make it like cool, but we're just gonna do we're gonna do the easy way here. We're just gonna boop, put a little square here. Bits I like. Keep people's attention, you know. Keep them engaged. Just for the just TikTok audience. With just like an eight bar loop of that, just to get the basic drums down. What if we do it like? And then it goes. I think what could be cool is just chopping out the so you don't hear the bass on the one of every time. So it's not like on every like beginning at every bar. But we could take that as a start. Like. But in terms of like drums, are you hearing like a particular kind of style? Beat battles like drill just always mm -hmm. sounds sick. But then yeah, can't good. really imagine this with drill. But we could always do like switch speed ups. Up and stuff. Actually, like perfectly in time. Yeah. All right. Oh god damn it! I feel like we have to do something with that first bit. Oh god damn it, dude! Wait, hold on. I fucked everything up. I, I was trying to get it to be too small. I'm trying to keep people engaged. Okay, this is important. This is important stuff. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're gonna leave it like this now. You guys can stay watching. Dude, it sounds like sped up. <laughs> it's a bit mad, but then I think definitely like a slower tempo. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so locked in now. Oh yeah. yeah. Nah, I think higher, yeah. if anything. Oh, okay, that's all right. Maximum engagement achieved. Oh, yeah. Then we need another one below, next to it, where it's uh, Family Guy. And then we need like the, the hopping on the trains. <laughs> so many different things to see. Yeah. I mean, that's a cool bass to start drums yeah, yeah. with. <laughs> okay. I like those bits. Nah, not that second bit. Maybe use this to as a drop, so this, we have this, and then it drops into the beat. Yeah, it can do. Yeah, chop up the vocal underneath it, maybe. Uh, oh. That's cool with the re I like how I'm doing this instead of watching the video. I mean, there's drums all the way through. <laughs> it sounds like sped up anyway. Okay, there we go, guys. We got the max. We're doing maximum engagement here. Oh, this is so solid. This is so solid. What is going on? I'm trying to keep people engaged, okay? So we're also watching cute animals in the left corner. <laughs> That was hard, but the drums are gonna be. Dude, I'm so overwhelmed right now. I don't even know what's going on in the video anymore. Finally, a stream for me. Yeah. <laughs> Put like shaper box on it, so it kind of like shaper box on it. My guy, dude, this is my guy. Oh, maybe some reverb. It might be able to work. I need to go back and see what they're doing. Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. This is too overwhelming for me. I need to. I need. We need to know. I need to know the answers. So, okay, here we go. This particular kind of style. Beat battles like drill just always mm. sounds sick, but then. I can't really imagine this. I think it's funny how, like, in the UK, they're like, oh, yeah, we should do, like, a drill beat. In America, we're just like, don't do a drill beat. For the love of God, don't do a drill beat. No more drill beats. It's for drill. But we could always do, like, switch speed ups. Up and stuff. Actually, like, perfectly in time. Yeah. Next stream, because five different videos going on at once. So that we have to do something with that first bit. Always got to mess with the pitch. What if this is the ultimate hack to, like, grow your Twitch channel? <laughs> Dude, it sounds like split up. <laughs> it's a bit mad, but then I think definitely like a slower tempo. Yeah. 
What do you guys need? Like three producers to cook up a beat, huh? Each producer doing like a drum or something. Oh yeah. yeah. But then like don't go down the engagement rabbit hole, or you'll be licking your microphone soon, senpai. If it gets us up to a consistent seventy-five viewers, I might. Animals look like they're dancing. That's a really cute cat, man. Nah, I think going quicker. We'll go higher. Yeah. Pitch, if anything. Oh, okay, that's alright. That'd be super funny if neither of them finished the beat. Oh yeah, that's nice, you know, that's nice. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's a cool bass to start drums yeah, with. Yeah. Okay. I like those bits. Nah, not that second bit. Maybe use this to as a drop, so this, we have this, and then it drops into the beat. Yeah, can do. Yeah, chop up the vocal underneath it, maybe. Nah. I like how they're so positive while working with each other. Nah. Oh. That's cool with the reverb. I mean, there's drums all the way through. I like how the lighting is not even good in this studio here. Wait, hold on. Like, not, even the lighting is fucking terrible in the $10 studio. So maybe they made it like that. So it's like, so you know we're working in the $10 studio, you know? Or what is that pig doing? <laughs> Who are these people? This is J, I think J Cac. What is it? I don't fucking know. I know Ocean is one of them. That's the only one I really know. Look at all those ducks. I like how people are just commenting on the, the animal video. I'll see what it sounds like sped up anyway. Yeah, the only one I really know is Ocean. I mean, I've heard of, uh, is it Cactus J or something? I don't know, wait, hold on, let me look. Produced by Jack, I think I've heard of him. He didn't link to anyone else in the description. Oh, wait, no, he did right here. J Cactus TV, I've heard of him. Loner, haven't heard of him. Loophole, Seven Inc, haven't heard of them. Yeah, I mean, that was hard, but the drums are gonna be yeah. Put like shaper box on it so it kind of like filters out. Maybe some reverb it might be able to. They're like, shut up, Ocean. We don't use shaper box here. I think the cheap studio had nicer monitors. It looks like the expensive. Hey, that, that expensive one had the monitors the wrong way, okay? Or what I perceive to be the wrong way. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. What? Oh, yeah, that first. I like how they just ignore that suggestion. They're like, yo, yo, put shaper box on it. Continues doing what they were doing. It's a bit just like repeating. Like, yeah. 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 I think that could work. Yeah. yeah. They so say you want to try something. Yeah, I was just Zombie. gonna quickly try and like chop the sample. Yeah, see what you can do. You know what? No. <laughs> <laughs> I heard something, but. So far, this one sounds better to me. Okay. Maybe just like change the ending part so it's so it's slightly different from the first. Yeah, that works. I like that a lot. Consolidate that real quick, and then just pitch it down like four semitones or some shit. Oh, bro, the bounce on this one, if you do a trap beat with them perks. I don't even know about trap, to be honest. Slow it down to like 70, see if it works for trap. Now that'll work. That's cool. Boom. Maybe a little bit faster, but yeah. Kind of out of time though, at this slow of a BPM, you can kind of tell. Yeah, but if you only if you filter out the perks, then... Not even using the console or the outboard gear? Yeah, I know. I feel like they don't have enough time either. It's one hour. Just that texture. So videos like this would not be possible without the support of our sponsor of today's video, Tracklib. If you guys are looking for samples, hip hop... I kind of had a feeling, man. I had a feeling because like they were getting the sample from Tracklib. Boom, bap, R&B, whatever genre you make, I guarantee you there's a sample for you on... Burial. Tracklib. Oh, it's an inspired collection. Tracklib is essentially a sample marketplace. It has a massive library of... Man, the clearance on Track... I mean, I mean, it's obviously it's cheaper than like regular clearance, but I'm like, clearance on Tracklib is pretty expensive, right? Tracklib is good though. Different samples to choose from. Unlike sampling from say vinyl or YouTube, you actually have a layer of protection with Tracklib where you can easily clear a sample to be used for say a placement with an artist or a sync or whatever it may be, you can very easily and cheaply clear any sample on here. That's why I like to sample with Tracklib. I think you guys will too. If you want to get- a Yeah, this video is hilarious because there's like a million cents in the background and they're not, they're not using that shit at all. They're all just still on the laptop regardless of what studio they're in. With Tracklib, you only have to pay for clearance once. You're ready to publish, right? I think so. I think they have different levels of clearance. Oh, wait, hold on. We got we to gotta play the next animal compilation clip. This is important. All right, cute baby animals. All right, all right this is important here. Trial with 15 download credits then make sure you check out Tracklib today by clicking my link down in the description. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's Automate the, the shaper box. I refuse to use Tracklib because it lives when. <sighs> yeah. Make the animals a little bit bigger. All right. <laughs> just, all right, dude. Is that better? Thing. So it just hits on this and it cuts out after. Oh, yeah, yeah. So yeah. see what it sounds like with the Jersey drums. And then all right, guys, is this better? 
<laughs> I mean, the bass would work with like other drums in there. What kind of chopper are you doing? Like something more simple. I think the first. Bit. How much time have they used so far? I feel like they've used a lot of time. I don't know how you guys feel, but just get rid of that. I yeah. just have this bit. Yeah. And like then it. this section would be like a different four bars. I don't like know, get repetitive like yeah, that, yeah, innit? It's kind of boring now. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go like a trap direction then ish. No, I don't know, just f around with it. You better have some good kits. <laughs> Plug, prop by Jack. <laughs> These chairs are comfy. Holy sh groundbreaking stuff here. Yeah, weird bounce, bro. Oh the bounce is weird. It's got like a like a swing to it. Yeah. The swing is throwing it off. Four on the floor kick. Yeah, I, I prefer it at this speed. That could be kind of hard. That could be kind of hard. Swing is, is I'll have to replicate. These are going to be two horrible beats. I mean, this sounds all right so far. In here somehow. It's going to be off for a minute. Off beat slightly. Mm, that's fine. I mean, as long as it doesn't sound. That's fine. <laughs> then... <laughs> I don't know. This one's tough to flip. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Should we like scrap the, the jersey idea? Yeah, yeah like, maybe. You know that first chop you got? We might have to just start with that. You know? No, I like this, the first four bars. Oh, you like the chop? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, good. It's that percussion, man. But I wonder what it sounds like now that it's been chopped. Dude, they should split it up. Like, use a, a stem splitter and then get the percussion out. That's not too bad. It sounds like a Christmas song now or something. Yeah. <laughs> We'll test all the different bounces and see what works. Like, we'll, we'll do Not even using Infiltrator 2 feels bad, man. Like a quick drill midi. But I don't think it's enough to be like a convincing win with just this. I think this is like, this makes for a cool intro. But like this this should lead into a switch up of some sort that's like actually like trap or some, some sort. Like the whole view. How much time have they used so far? I feel like they've used a lot of time here. I don't want to go too crazy into this if we don't want to make this the main no, section. No, no, no. This, this, this is a good section. This is worth exploring a bit. Let's just, let's just add to it, like, synths or whatever, or, or bass or something. Mm. Perfect pitch low. No. They need to have the time on screen, man. <laughs> I, there would be a lot more intensity here if I knew how much time was left, because I really feel like they use a lot of time at this point. Cactus is going to force it to be a drill beat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, that's hard. Trust the process. What if you slow mm. this down to 100 again? <laughs> I need to know how much time is left. This is driving me crazy. Speed it to 110. <laughs> Not free. <laughs> I just don't think that's like a beast battle. Yeah, yeah it's true. more like a vibe. We're gonna end up going drill. <laughs> I mean, I'm down to try anything, <laughs> but we just <laughs> we need energy. We going back to drill. God damn it. Let me try a bounce then and see if it actually works. <laughs> I mean, we could just just drop a drop a loop. <laughs> oh, like, they can learn a thing or two from Wave Wars. Wave Wars always has the time on screen. We also have cats on the screen too. Just a perk from the sample and then yeah, yeah. yeah. It would get away with that. <laughs> 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 it just sounds dead. It makes the drums match better, but now it just sounds dead. I hear the potential. Really? Trust the process of this one. <laughs> Me. To me, this beat is hard already. Oh, what? It's weird, but yeah, I mess with this. Speakers in this house. They're using that that's that sound and using it kind of a lot there. So good though. Try and find a sound that sounds good over there. I want to get a lead, a distorted lead over there. Yeah. <laughs> I think it would be really sick to have a section with no with no time is left. Well, like, with just the perks. <laughs> Hear that? Oh yeah. <laughs> dude, that sound, dude. It sounds like a chihuahua or something. <laughs> yeah, but not like shoot. Not like shoot, huh? Alright. <laughs> What do we do? We're sample. We're stuck. It just sounds dead. <laughs> oh my god, please tell me that I, dude, that'd be crazy if they come to the conclusion like, well, if you work in a $10 studio, it's gonna suck. That doesn't sound too bad. What if we just start with that? Just, that's yeah. what At least yeah. we get a beat. Oh yeah, instantly. Yeah, that's yeah. better. And we could just build from that. All right, we're back in the game. <laughs> you can even like, put parts of the sample in there now, like that. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, that's hard. Yeah. yeah. We could do that bouncing like one part. Yeah. There we go. It's a yeah. bit cheesy, but like something. <laughs> Ooh, okay. I think we're on the right track. What time are we on now? It's like 30, minutes. 35 minutes. Okay, this drum beat's good. 
Not all B has to be wrapped on though, or it needs to be uh, four wrappers. Drill eight way yeah. to hit on the one line. Yeah, that's hard. Are we doing like a switch up? Yeah. I feel like we should. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's that what is happening. Transition. Yeah, that's fine. We'll keep that for sure. That could be cool, is it? Just, just loop that bit. This is what I'm saying, bro. This, this is why we've got the advantage, because we've got all this shit just there. They got nothing. They got their laptop. That... But that could also be a distraction too, right? Yeah. yeah, the fancy studio one is super cluttered, yeah. That one is stupid. That one is cool. stupid. Make it that unique. Ooh. That's hard too. Filter that out, though. That's weird. Bro, that shit don't even sound that good, though. It is, right? it is weird. It's very like. How is he playing a Moog? I thought they were dead. Busy work beats. They shouldn't listen to that Weaver Beats guy, dude. Mind the Ten. See if we can mess around with it. See. What the others are doing? I doubt they'll be doing the same thing as us. <laughs> Yeah, so far there sounds way better, dude. <laughs> I'll go after the club. Leave it. Hard, <laughs> yeah, that could be like before it. The $10 studio is killing them so far. Drop though. Should we do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah let me do that quick. <laughs> the accidental. accidental tricks. We might as well just put like that bit with some drill drums for a section. Oh, I dropped hard. Let me get the kick in as well. <laughs> we got this. We always do like the most work in like the last 10 minutes anyway, don't we? Digging the pets. That's what it's there for, man. Either the bit with the little like the, the gated sound again. That's got a bounce, you know? And then I mean, it's all about how you use it. I mean, you can play the most expensive synth in the world and it doesn't matter if the context of it doesn't sound good with what you're doing. Ah, 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 that sounds like a bird, bro. It's a vibe. All it needs is structuring to me. The, the beat is hard enough as it is. With the sample changes, yeah. Oh, I see. I you see, always see. win by getting the switch up. Because I guarantee they've done one. Maybe on the second half, you pitch it up an octave. Oh, yeah. That could be cool. It's very hard. Very hard. Very hard. Which one do you guys think is better? $1,000 studio or $10? It sound nice, but the perks are kind of dead. It could, it could work. It could I'm work. just going to filter it and stick it into here. Oh, all right. All right, boys. Final 15. This is something. This is something. <laughs> Considering where we were. Stop yeah. It. Well, no, I feel like Jack, they're definitely going to do a switch up. Right. Oh my God. They're both. Yeah, they're definitely going to do a switch up. Trust the FL keys will stop. Neither the cute ass dog wins. True. And then we'll play it on a synth or something or I don't know. Now, now put it on a synth. Put it on a synth. Needs something that's polyphonic. I don't know if any of these are polyphonic. All right, analog lab. I feel like to really get this a real test, like they need it more than an hour. An hour is not long enough to like really utilize the stuff in this expensive studio. We're gonna use the, the Louis Flynn banks, loophole.com. Ah, oh, that's cool, it's all right. That's kind of nice. Yeah, that's cool. Wait, no, drop drop down the C, you're not, no, no, drop down the actual C, no, no, yeah. Nice. That kind of lifts up a little bit, and then the hardest section should be without the chords. The chord, the chords could be cool for like a build-up. We gotta move fast. We ain't got time for this. What have you got in mind? Just like a different chop for the sample. Just to add in like a vocal chop underneath it on this side. Oh shit! That's cool. Maybe something different here. Maybe we do like the jersey bounce here. Yeah. How much time we got? Ten, ten minutes. Folks, right, Scarlet resting nicely on a 100k console. <laughs> I didn't notice that. That's funny. Yeah. yeah, I like that. Let me try something real quick. Just cut out the drums for some. We, some need, we need an intro. We need an intro. Do the intro first. <laughs> no, that can't be the intro. That can't be the fucking intro. You know what would really help with the editing here? If they had like a, a uh, like a heartbeat that like slowly starts building up towards the end of the, the time running out here. Uh, sha, sha. Mm. Mm -hmm. Quick, quick, quick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, quick, quick, I don't know if this is going to sound good. Honestly, I do not know if this is going to sound good. Yeah, we can do this. That's actually hard. What about that? Yeah. And it was a fine vocal top Yeah.
<laughs> Dude, the way they zoomed in on his fingers there, that was funny. What about that? Yeah. And there was a fine vocal top tip. He's fondling something there. Weaver's a and YouTube videos. I mean, there's some pretty good video editors on YouTube. Like I think Kyle Beats videos are like really well made. Like I said, I don't I don't hate like any of these people. Like while I don't really like Drip and like a lot of the plugins he makes and stuff like that, I do think his videos are really well made. Kyle makes some like pretty good YouTube videos. They're really entertaining. Like I feel like this video could learn a lot from one of Kyle Beats videos. In terms of like, wait, set up. Wait a minute, is it playing a compilation or something down there? Hold on, wait, whoop, hold on. Ah, okay, I guess we're done. I guess we're done with the, the cute, the cute animal. Sh Sorry guys, hopefully don't, hopefully everyone doesn't leave now. FL, come on. <laughs> We ain't got time. time for this. We ain't got time for this. Okay, we get the intro and then anything. Dude, imagine it just crashes. Final changes we need to make. Do something. Drag, drag Do something. I don't know what you want. Okay, we need to structure it. We need to structure it. That drop is mid. I don't know how to make it better though. <laughs> that drop is mid. Oh, for sake. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Oh, I love me. Now we gotta stare at Weaver. I'm sorry guys. Uh, Weaver is kind of like a cute animal. Oh, thanks. We're <laughs> done. Okay, we're done. Three, that's fine, that's fine. Two, one, and we're done. That was stressed. It always is, but... No, well, I think it came out all right. I feel like they probably had the same problem as us, definitely. Let's see who's going first. One, two, three. How did it get there so fast? There you go. All right, you guys go first. Oh, <laughs> oh get out. Oh. Percussion is sick. I like the percussion. This beat's kind of dope, actually. B is mids? Uh, it's not that bad, man. I don't know. For one hour while having to flip a sample, it's not bad. Yeah, that was very really sick. That was cold, you know. We panicked for like the first 20 minutes, didn't we? Yeah. What, did it all come together at the end? Yeah. yeah with that sample for a long time. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. the percussion that us up. Now it's our turn. That'd be super funny if they were like way too competitive. Like the, the opponent's like, this is trash. Like in the first two seconds. This one is way worse in my opinion. <laughs> Dude, the synth line. What the hell was that? Let's go back. See, that's what we got by doing the thousand dollar a day studio. We got to do that. You hear that right there? That's from the thousand dollar a day studio. To know which one you think is better unbiased opinion that moke sound is so offensive <laughs> okay i can see why they sold it now i can see why they sold it yeah. i prefer the first one for me okay. <laughs> i like the groove of it. yeah i like that something about the first one let us know down in the comments which beat you guys think was the best we want to know what you guys think so yeah vote down in the comments below check out all the producers that were involved in this video i mean regardless of what people say about that video i mean it was pretty entertaining it wasn't as entertaining as like how beats editing is like i think if they took like a page out of his editing like the style the way he like puts together these sort of videos it probably would have came out like quite a bit better but overall that was pretty interesting i thought not clicking with any of this i mean i think the first beat was better a good old-fashioned beat off they could have made 100 tracks for that price true i mean i feel like there's not obviously it doesn't really prove anything it, i guess like the the real thing at the end of the day is it doesn't really matter what you use i think it is interesting though that the thousand dollar studio one came out worse and i think part of the reason too is they were kind of distracted by everything they had in there like they wanted to use the mogs because they had access to them but then like it didn't help in any way if anything it made it worse Incorporated.